Honoring and celebrating the dead tonight in Ontario, families remember their loved ones on Dia de los Muertos. It's a tradition dating back thousands of years. KCAL News reporter Nicole Comstock takes you to Ontario where families set up altars. We're here under the twinkly lights in Ontario for a beautiful night to remember the loved ones that people have lost at these altars. But this was also very much a celebration of their lives. At dusk on this Dia de los Muertos, hundreds of people came out to celebrate the time-honored tradition, which originated in Mexico, right here on Euclid Avenue in Ontario. Proud Grandpa Mario Martinez is taking pictures of his granddaughter, Penelope. It's fantastic because it's part of the culture. Actually, I came from Mexico and it's, it's a good deal that she's following on her roots. The 11 year old is one of many young girls and boys who entertain the crowd with folkloric dance performances. I just really love like dancing. But Penelope says it goes deeper than dancing. What she's really doing is teaching different communities about her culture through the art form. It does, since like we get to go around and just perform at different places. This is a tribute to life and to death. Ofrendas or altars have been built here to honor lost loved ones and keep their memories alive. It is believed that during this time every November, the spirits of those who have passed return home to be with their families. It's remembering your, your ancestors and paying respect for all the people. It's about knowing where and who you've come from and taking pride in your origins. And many here say when they grew up, they didn't see as many Dia de los Muertos events here in Southern California. Here's another one from Olvera Street in downtown LA. So it's great to see that all the cities are participating and taking a part of the, of, of the culture of their citizens. You know, so it's a, it's a better representation of everybody. And these altars will be up from now through Sunday. Reporting in Ontario, I'm Nicole Comstock, KCAL News.